Welcome to this insightful exploration of the current economic recession and its devastating impact on industries. Today we delve into the depths of an ultimate crisis that has caused numerous industries to collapse and face unprecedented challenges. The recession we're experiencing has been triggered by a culmination of factors, including global economic instability, shifts in consumer behavior and disruptions in supply chains. These factors have created a perfect storm, leaving various industries vulnerable to collapse. The manufacturing and industrial sector, once a cornerstone of economic stability, has been hit hard by the recession. Declining consumer demand, reduced spending power and disruptions in global trade have significantly impacted manufacturing industries. Manufacturing plants across various sectors are witnessing decreased orders and sharp decline in production. As consumers tighten their budgets and prioritize essential expenses, demand for non-essential goods and durable goods such as automobiles and appliances has plummeted. This has forced manufacturing companies to scale back production, leading to factory closures and layoffs. Furthermore, the manufacturing industry heavily relies on global supply chains and international trade. With travel restrictions and disruptions in logistics, the flow of raw materials and components has been severely disrupted. Many manufacturers have struggled to source necessary inputs, resulting in production delays and increased costs. The impact of the recession extends beyond traditional manufacturing sectors. Industries such as aerospace, heavy machinery and construction, which rely on large-scale projects and investments, have experienced significant setbacks. With reduced infrastructure spending and postponed projects, companies in these sectors are facing a challenging road to recovery. However, amidst the challenges, the manufacturing sector has historically demonstrated its ability to evolve and adapt in times of crisis. Some manufacturers have shifted their production lines to produce essential goods such as medical equipment and personal protective equipment to meet the urgent needs of healthcare systems and frontline workers. Moreover, the recession has accelerated the adoption of advanced technologies and automation in manufacturing processes. Companies are embracing robotics, artificial intelligence and Internet of Things solutions to enhance productivity, reduce costs and mitigate future risks. This transformative shift towards Industry 4.0 not only improves operational efficiency, but also creates new opportunities for skilled workers in emerging fields. In addition, governments and policymakers are recognizing the importance of the manufacturing sector in driving economic growth and resilience. They are implementing support measures such as tax incentives, grants and training programs to stimulate investment, promote innovation and ensure the long-term competitiveness of the manufacturing industry. While the road to recovery for the manufacturing sector may be challenging, it's important to recognize the sector's significance in driving job creation, technological advancement and economic prosperity. By embracing innovation, diversifying product offerings and exploring new markets, manufacturers can adapt to the evolving landscape, rebuild these industries and contribute to the overall recovery of the economy. The recession has delivered a severe blow to the retail and consumer goods industry as consumer spending patterns undergo significant shifts and economic uncertainty looms large. Retailers of all sizes are grappling with declining scales, reduced foot traffic and a shift towards online shopping. As consumers prioritize essential items and tighten their budgets, discretionary spending on non-essential goods has significantly declined. This has led to store closures, bankruptcies and a wave of job losses within the retail sector. Brick and mortar retailers, already facing challenges from the rise of e-commerce, have been particularly hit hard. Many traditional retailers are struggling to compete with online giants and are re-evaluating their business models. As a result, we've witnessed a surge in bankruptcies and store closures, leaving once vibrant shopping districts with vacant storefronts. The impact of the recession is not limited to traditional retail, luxury brands and high-end consumer goods, which heavily rely on consumer confidence and discretionary spending, have experienced a significant downturn. As consumers tighten their belts, luxury goods sales have plummeted, leading to revenue losses and reshaping of the luxury market. However, amidst the challenges, retailers are embracing digital transformation and omni-channel strategies to adapt to the changing landscape. E-commerce has experienced a significant surge in demand as consumers turn to online shopping for convenience and safety. Retailers are investing in robust online platforms, enhancing their logistics capabilities and leveraging data analytics to understand consumer behavior and personalize the shopping experience. 
The recession has dealt a devastating blow to the hospitality and tourism industry as travel restrictions, lockdown measures and cautious consumer behaviour have brought travel and tourism activities to a standstill. Hotels, resorts and restaurants have experienced a sharp decline in bookings, event cancellations and a significant decrease in dining customers. Many establishments, particularly smaller businesses, have been forced to shut down permanently, resulting in widespread job losses and financial distress within the industry. Travel restrictions and health concerns have severely impacted international and domestic travel. Airlines have faced unprecedented challenges with flight cancellations, reduced capacity and the need to implement stringent health and safety protocols. The cruise industry has also been severely impacted as cruise lines suspend operations and face diminished demand. The ripple effects of the recession are felt across the entire tourism ecosystem. Travel agencies, tour operators and attractions are grappling with reduced bookings and revenue losses. Local businesses dependent on tourist spending, such as souvenir shops, restaurants and transportation services, are also experiencing significant setbacks. As travel restrictions gradually ease and vaccination rates increase, the recovery of the hospitality and tourism industry remains uncertain. Rebuilding consumer confidence in travel and ensuring the safety and hygiene of destinations will be crucial to revive tourism activities. Additionally, the industry must adapt to changing travel preferences, such as the rise of ecotourism, wellness tourism and experiential travel. In response to the crisis, many businesses in the hospitality and tourism sector have focused on implementing enhanced health and safety measures. These include rigorous cleaning protocols, contactless services and flexible cancellation policies to instill confidence in travellers and prioritise their well-being. Furthermore, governments and tourism boards have implemented various initiatives to support the recovery of the industry and stimulate tourism activities. This includes promotional campaigns, discounted travel packages and financial incentives for both domestic and international travellers. Governments have also extended financial aid and relief programs to support struggling businesses and preserve jobs within the sector. However, the road to recovery for the hospitality and tourism industry remains challenging. It will require close collaboration between governments, tourism stakeholders and health authorities to restore consumer confidence and ensure the safe resumption of travel. Additionally, industry players are exploring innovative strategies to adapt to the changing landscape. This includes diversifying offerings to cater to local and regional tourists, investing in sustainable tourism practices and leveraging digital platforms to enhance the customer experience and reach a wider audience. The revival of the hospitality and tourism industry is not only crucial for businesses and jobs, but also for the overall economy. Tourism plays a significant role in driving economic growth, supporting local communities and preserving cultural heritage. By collectively working towards recovery, the industry can emerge stronger, more resilient and ready to welcome travellers back to unforgettable experiences. The financial services and banking sector, which forms the backbone of the economy, is not immune to the recession's impact. The strain on businesses and individuals has resulted in increased loan defaults, impairments and reduced profitability for banks. Banks face challenges in managing their loan portfolios, particularly in industries most affected by the recession. They must navigate potential bankruptcies, negotiate debt restructurings and handle the risk of non-performing loans. This in turn affects the ability to provide credit to businesses and individuals, further exacerbating the economic downturn. Additionally, financial markets experience increased volatility as investors navigate uncertain economic conditions. Stock market fluctuations and declining asset values impact investment portfolios, pension funds and individual wealth, amplifying the sense of financial instability. While many industries are collapsing due to the recession, the technology and innovation sector presents a unique perspective. This sector has witnessed both challenges and opportunities during the crisis. On one hand, tech startups face significant hurdles in securing funding and maintaining operations as investors exercise caution and prioritize capital preservation. Many startups are grappling with reduced demand for their products or services, delayed product launches and supply chain disruptions. On the other hand, the recession has also highlighted the importance of technology in navigating the crisis. Remote work solutions, e-commerce platforms and digital communication tools have experienced increased demand as businesses and individuals adapt to new ways of operating.
tech companies offering essential services such as telehealth and online learning have seen a surge in demand. Furthermore, the recession has spurred innovation and accelerated digital transformation efforts. Businesses across industries are leveraging technology to streamline operations, improve efficiency, and reach customers in new ways. This has opened up opportunities for tech companies that provide digital solutions and transformative technologies. In response to the collapsing industries and widespread impact of the recession, governments have implemented various measures to support affected sectors and stimulate economic recovery. Fiscal stimulus packages have been introduced to provide financial aid to businesses, support job retention and provide income support to individuals. These initiatives aim to alleviate the immediate financial strain and encourage spending to revive industries. Central banks have taken action by implementing monetary policy measures such as lowering interest rates and injecting liquidity into financial markets. These measures aim to promote lending, support credit availability and stabilize the financial system. Governments are also exploring industry-specific interventions and incentives to aid the recovery of heavily affected sectors. This includes targeted support for small businesses, investment in infrastructure projects and initiatives to promote domestic tourism and consumer spending. As we look ahead, the road to recovery from this ultimate crisis remains challenging. The pace and trajectory of the recovery will depend on various factors, including the effectiveness of government interventions, the successful containment of the virus and the restoration of consumer confidence. Rebuilding industries will require adaptation, innovation and a focus on resilience. Businesses will need to reassess their strategies, identify new opportunities and embrace digital transformation to thrive in a post-recession landscape. It's important to note that the impacts of the recession will be felt differently across industries. While some sectors may experience a faster recovery, others may undergo significant transformations or face prolonged challenges. Ultimately, navigating through the crisis requires collaboration between governments, businesses and individuals. By working together, implementing prudent strategies and embracing innovation, industries can gradually recover, adapt to the new normal and lay the foundation for future growth. That concludes our exploration of the collapsing industries due to the recession. We hope that this comprehensive overview has shed light on the far-reaching consequences of the ultimate crisis. Join us next time as we continue to delve into the ever-evolving landscape of the global economy.